I'm Hussain Belay. In this video, we will see how we can enrich our universal Windows applications using um, pie charts. In the previous video, we saw how we can uh, add those user controls inside our Xamarin Forms application. And then today, we will add this control to our Windows universal application. So here I have created a new Windows uh, universal application by going and select a new project and selecting this uh, template, blank app universal windows. The first thing to do is to go to my project, then right click and select manage NuGet packages. Here I'll go and look for a package called uh, crosspycharts.uwp. Here is crosspycharts.uwp, select install. The install will add a .dll um, package that contains all the references and all the, um, the objects that we will use later. So here it is added. So now I can go to my main page and add a new namespace, XMLNS, let's call it um, charts. Let's call cross by charts dot UWP pie ch dot uh, pie charts. And here I can go to use that namespace charts. Here I have two objects which are the pie chart and the rich pie chart. The pie chart is a simple element. But what you want to use is the rich pie chart. For the rich pie chart you have uh, different parameters you can uh, choose from so for the radius for example let's choose a radius of 200 so you see the radius 200 then the, you can change the stroke thickness to be for example uh, 30 or 50 for example so here it is uh, now you maybe want to um, uh, to select your own uh, percentages here and your own colors for that you go and add a new um, a new uh, view model let's call it main view model for your public class main view model you should have a property of type list pie chart args for pie chart args is the object that will contain the information about uh, every uh, segment of this pie chart so let's initialize this collection by uh, in the uh, constructor let's get a better view so i'll go select pie chart collection equal new pie chart collection let's create our collection so for the first item pie chart arcs that contains um, two properties the first one is the percentage let's say for example it's 15 then let's choose the color color brush new solid color brush let's choose between all the rich colors and windows universal so colors um, i'll go and choose the uh, dark cyan for example so this is going to be the first segment i'll go and add a new one and fourth one and i'll go and change also the percentages here 25 this is 40 so 
55 for example run here i will go and select let's see it's now 60 okay and 25 can change here the colors dark sand now dark um, let's say dark orange for example then here dark green and here let's choose um, dark uh, blue for example now I want to bind this property to my um, rich pie charts so it gets these uh, these values instead of these de um, default values so the way to do that is by going to debug or to build sorry and click build solution then i go here to properties and in the data context let's select a new so new will bring me um, the main view model here inside my uh, namespace app okay now that i have added uh, the data context i can go here and select um, the collection which is by chart arcs collection and now i should bind to um, to the pie chart collection now you see how it changes now choosing the the colors we have uh, selected inside our view model remember these colors dark cyan orange uh, green then the blue color with these uh, proper with these percentages so here it is the view you will get so let's try and run it So here it is your view inside your Windows Universal application. So thank you.